Now, welcome everybody to God. I can't even believe I'm saying this. I can't. I can't. I can't. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> guys, this is a game that's been highly requested by you guys uh, for me to check out. Life is Strange, and I'm going to keep it a stack with y'all. Uh, I heard the game was ass. I'm, I'm laying it out. I've seen a lot of reviews, and they all said it was ass. Honestly, that's the only reason I kind of stayed away from this game is because I didn't want to disappoint myself. I kind of don't want to leave Life is Strange off on a good note. I played literally every single Life is Strange. We played them here on the channel. And honestly, I wanted to leave it off on a good note. Like it was a chapter. I didn't want to open it back up, especially if I read all the reviews and they're all saying it's ass. Now, I'm not going to waste too much of your time. Let's get into it. We, we about to check it out. Honestly, this might be a one-off episode. I don't know. If I like it, I like it. If I don't, I don't. And by the looks of it, damn, hold on. Hold on. We got to put on our own drip? Hold on. Hey, I thought this was a polo for a second. Chapter one, still life. All right. Music by... I, I didn't read that. Um... Square Enix. Man, I'm really hoping it's not Cheeks, y'all. I'm hoping it's not Cheeks. I really... I don't know. Let me just... <sighs> let's just... Let's just try to enjoy this. Deck 9. Okay. How the hell did they do that? I'm pretty sure it was busted locked, no? Oh my god. Dude, the graphics feel weird. I mean, they're realistic, but they don't feel like the... Let me not hate! I can't hate yet. Well, I'll be damned. I didn't know you were a criminal mastermind, Miss Caulfield. <laughs> There's a lot you don't know about me. Dude. Truly, is nothing easy? How do we get around that? <sighs> I'm not despairing yet. Let me take a look. Okay. Walk around. Rewind hasn't worked in years. But still. I, I literally tried to rewind. Old habits die hard. I literally tried to rewind. Damn, Max grew up. I'm not about to leave before I've gotten a few good photos of this joint. Okay. I hope whoever Neb is, they don't mind that I'm in their pub. And if they do mind, I hope I can take them. Oh, yeah. Easy peasy. Sure about this? Positive. Okay. Let's lift it then. Why you gotta do all that talking? Just lift that hoe. <laughs> Where are we? That's the that's the one person. Where's my glasses at? Uh, damn. Wait for it. Go. Talk about descending into the mouth of hell. Hmm, hell is right. It's incredible. I think this is the part where we abandon all hope. Ooh. All hope of not contracting tetanus, maybe. <laughs> uh, I had a friend in undergrad who was obsessed with this building. She never broke in, though. She clearly wasn't as crazy as you. <laughs> Urban exploration is kind of my thing. I can't see a busted old place and simply not go into it. What is it about empty spaces? The potential? Uh, I don't know. An abandoned building has the potential to be anything. Just by going inside, I make it into something new. Hey. 
Hell yeah. Let's hit the bar. Not a bad shot. Oh, let me just... Don't! What? I don't usually rearrange the space if I can help it. I want it to look exactly like it would without human interference. Got huh? it. Hands off. Is there anything that I should be doing? Kind of like Safi. Looking pretty. Just sit still and look pretty. <gasps> the job I was born for. <laughs> hey, kind of. I, I kind of like her. I can't lie. Take photographs and uh, of the environment. Okay. Uh, tequila. So what are we looking for exactly, besides photographing random detritus? Most of the shoots I do, I find a focus. Something to hang the rest of the series on. I'll know when I see it. Something... lonely. The loneliest thing you can find. Gotcha, boss. It's giving me Spider-Man and Miles Morales graphics. Oof. Try not to breathe too deep. This place looks like it's 90% asbestos. Huh. Look. Speak. What are you smiling about? Oh. Nothing. Sorry, hold on. Let me change my graphics, because I feel like they're ass. Oh no, they're on high. Why 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 did it look blurry? Alright, let's see. Um Photograph the bowling alley. Come on, Max. Bob Gotta focus on the Something here and now. to bring you back to the beginning. Imagine that. Ooh. I remember. Bowling Weird kid. Lanes. Wow. It looks so much cleaner than it did online. Are there photos? Yeah. The old website is still up. I wonder who's paying the hosting fees. Someone who loves kitsch. And dust. Hmm. Honestly. It's hard right there. Album cover. All right. Guess these haven't been greased in a minute. I'm glad Sophie's having fun. Hate to bring an unappreciative audience to a trespassing. Maybe if I just ignore this, nothing will pop out of it. Well, maybe I want something to pop out of it. Ooh, I should have figured out this. Hail Satan. Hmm. Edgy. Ready to pledge yourself to the Prince of Lies? Uh... <laughs> people are bad enough. I don't go in for angels or demons. People are nasty enough all on their own. Don't I know it. Ah, uh, yes. Abraxas. Those guys really get around. Hmm. Uh, photographed the bowling alley. I thought we did that already, though. Okay, I'll do it again. I'm so glad Softly. Sh Good thing this building isn't on campus. My mom would definitely have had it raised to the ground by now. Hmm. Yeah, good thing. That would suck. Something doesn't have to be useful to be worth preserving. Do gumballs have an expiration date? Probably. Free hugs. I'll pass. What? Everybody need a free hug. Is this seizing the means of production? Okay. I like the art style. I can't even front. Some of this is hard. Nah, this is kind of hard. I can't lie. Uh, photograph the bowling alley. I think I did that already. Did I not? 
Ooh, this is tough. I told you this place was the portal to hell. Behold, a devil. Aw, it's cute. I I'm saying, like dude, this is kind of tough, though. Yeah? I think it looks like Mr. Peanut on meth. And I hate it. I wonder if there's any way to get it out of here. What? You mean steal it? Hmm. It's not stealing. It's not stealing if it's abandoned. Not sure that would hold up in court. I about to say. Well, doesn't even matter. It's way too big to drag out with just the two of us. Hmm. My money's on one half full Bic lighter to win it all. Oh man, I'm nine years late for my free slice of za. Huh? Za? Behold, oh, for sale, bowling shoes, extremely worn. I'm gonna take a picture right here. Shoes? Are shoes lonely? Super lonely. Sans feet. Shoes were the subject of the first photo of mine your mom ever saw. Oh my god. <sighs> this year's Caledon University artist in residence sent my mom foot pics? <laughs> she sent me some too. I guess there are just some things about your mom you don't Why? know. I'm gonna throw up. It was a shot of a messy closet in a condemned house. Someone left behind all their shoes. Your mom loved it. Hypocritical of her considering she never liked it when my closet was messy. But... All right. Guess what's the most random photo ever? But you know what? We'll take it. Figured out what your focus is gonna be yet? Not yet, but I'll know it when I see it. Hmm. Oh, the details. You heard the winds? See that? That's details. Can't go through there. I've never bowled anything above a 180. Way to go, Doug. Oh. Oh, Doug, no. Okay, my dude's a baller. Out here doing it all. Is um, this seizing the means of production? Yeah, we looked at all this. I think we're good, right? Ooh, it's hard. They must have thought something was worth preserving back when they closed this place down. So much for never rearranging a space. Damn. I bet that was stunning when it caught the light. Oh shit. That's it, huh? Hmm? The centerpiece you wanted, right? The loneliest thing in here or whatever. It was made to be beautiful. And now no one ever looks at it. Until today. <laughs> Something like that. Aha uh ha. -huh. Come on, bro. I take Not a photo. in love with this angle, though. Yo, there. Max. Max feels different. Help me find a way up. You got it, boss. Hmm. Find a way to get upstairs. Well, we don't have our powers. If a roof collapses in a bowling alley and no one is around to hear it. Can you still collect the insurance money? The world may never know. I'm saying though, couldn't that be an entrance? Oh, right here. No thanks, I value my ankles. Bro, what? How else are we gonna get up? No way you're doing that. Bitch, I said help me. Don't just look around looking clueless. Is you gonna help me? I'll climb this. OK. 
Oke. Okay. Oh. You okay? So useless. Damn. Yeah. I I'm fine. That could have been bad. See, this is why you need an assistant, in case you break your ass and need an ass ambulance. <laughs> Go get your shot. Let me figure out how to get you back down. All right. You sure you gonna figure that out? Let's find that shot. I don't think she's gonna figure it out, y'all. I think I gotta figure it out myself. How are your parkour skills? The nebula. Interesting. Okay. All right. Oh, wow. Oh, now she wants to get it, right? Now she want to get it. <laughs> wow. Ballet service, too? This place is bougie. Please remember to tip your ladder driver. Did you get your shot? And let's get the hell out of this death trap. Yeah, all right, let's get down. Come on. Bro, what kind of ladder is this? You sure this is 31? Come on, I'm starving. This loneliness makes me want a sandwich. Oof. Beautiful dismount. Check this out. It's perfect. Oh, show me the angle. Oh my uh -oh. god. What? I thought I was gonna use my powers right there and then. Are you okay? <laughs> oh, I need a drink. Do you need a drink? You read my mind. Uh, turtle? Turtle. Hmm, turtle. My powers might not last. That's okay. We will. I'm just... Holy! Max. Matt. You dead? Chloe. Oh, Where is Chloe? I'm, I mean, no. Not dead. Just thinking. Hmm. Cosmopolitan for Max. Vodka shot for Safi. Very on brand in both cases. Perfect. Thanks a ton, Amanda. Hey, you look really good today. You think so? I switched shampoos. Oh, not sure about it yet. So, what are you up to later? <laughs> uh, I ain't gonna lie, I'm going to sleep. If there is a just and loving God, sleep. Today's been a doozy. Ah. Well, sweet dreams. You know she was flirting with you, right? What? Amanda, are you actually this oblivious? Uh, I, I'm, yes. Oh, guilty. Flirting is like a foreign language to me. You spent all those years on the road, meeting new people every day, and you still can't tell when someone's into you? I don't know. You don't meet a lot of suitors in abandoned buildings. <gasps> Is this about the blue-haired girl whose picture you keep in your wallet? Wait, you snooped in my wallet? Stop deflecting. The girl with the blue hair. What's the deal with you two? Bro, she's talking about Chloe? I ain't gonna lie, my story ended off with just friends. I can't, can't I can't lie to you. Just an old friend. 
from when I was a kid. I never took that path of them being, Must um, have been some friend if you still keep you know? a picture in your wallet. Don't use your daytime TV shrink voice on me. New subject. No, come on. You never talk about yourself. Would it kill you to open up the teeny tiniest bit? What happened? We grew apart? She died. Wait a second, what? I don't remember Chloe dying. After high school, she was my road trip buddy. For a few years anyway. But... But? I don't know. I guess everyone processes stuff differently. And eventually, she couldn't deal with how I process stuff. Bit of advice. If anyone offers to publish your memoir, hire a ghostwriter. You suck at this. Ugh. Can we please change the subject now? Deal. Amanda. Thoughts? Bro, what do you mean thoughts? All the <laughs> she's not my type. What the obviously I have a huge crush. It's crazy, bro. She's not mm, my type. Maybe I'm in the minority here, but she's not really my type. She's really cool, though. Max, you're always talking about how you feel rootless. Maybe a new friend would be a good way to set down some roots. Talk to her. About what? What do normal people even talk about? Mostly gas prices. But we're aiming a little bit higher. I mean, go look around. She's responsible for half the decor in this place. Learn what she likes. Yeah. Yeah. Why the hell not, you know? Okay, then. Wait, so I kind of had to like her? Oh. Yep. Okay. Ooh. Time to go be normal. Okay, learn more about All Amanda's I have to interests. Do is find some things Amanda likes. So fucking okay, over. I got a new message. Wait, over him. Like I haven't heard that one before. What is it? Where am I? Uh, let me. I got some new messages. Chloe, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. We got a lot. Okay. <sighs> so Chloe is still alive. Um. Okay. So everyone who said Chicago. Wait, who's Moses? Okay. So everyone who said Chicago's winters are unbearable. They were. Grossly underestimating my ancestors are freezing. I don't know. I kind of like it. It's literally so cold. It's impossible to think about anything. All my friends, all my problems don't magically disappear. They're just replaced by more immediate and brutal ones. It's refreshing. Plus, hello, mortal. Uh, Chloe actually drinks Malora. It's a bit. You don't have any commitment. That it's hard to bit. Also, you text me from this from your hotel room with the theros thermostat set to the surface of Venus. Right? Venus is. Lovely this time of the year. You coming down or not? Yeah, five more minutes. Um, what do you want me to order you? Wait, is this Chloe? No, that was Sophie. Who was I just reading? Who was I just reading? Oh, I think I was reading. No, that was Chloe. Okay. What do you want me to order you, my lord? Uh, hey, I snuck out early while you were asleep, but real quick, how much chocolate do you think you could eat today? Is it National George yourself on Sweets Day or something? Exactly, no, but it is the day after Valentine's and it's on the sale. So, shit, it's almost 10.30. Why don't you tell me? I didn't know I had to. What happens at 10.30? Nothing. There's a Mary Calvin exhibit this week and tickets went on sale at 10. I was going to take you as a surprise. Well... If you want to get up in time to get those tickets, I can make that happen. Max, no. I don't need you to rewind and make it all better. I'm a big girl. I can live with my mistakes. What is that supposed to mean? I didn't mean it like that, Max. Come on. I don't have to live with my mistakes because there's a place on the coast we used to call home that says otherwise. And how many times do I have to tell you that I never asked you to make that choice? I never would ask you that. You're my best friend, Chloe. I know you would never ask, and I... Think about the decision every goddamn day. Look, I'm sorry, okay? 
Chloe, you really are the best. Okay, so they end off on good notes. Moses. All right, let's learn about Amanda's interests. Um, Amanda probably knows which beer is actually good. I could ask her. So are we forced to kind of like Amanda, even though they give us options to kind of not like Amanda? Busy night? Oh, Julie called off. So I haven't gotten a single break all shift. My bladder's about to explode. Go pee. You can talk to me later. It's a fabulous idea. Don't go anywhere. That's the third glass this week, Reggie. I got this bathroom now. You well, are a little no. angel. Hell no, I we don't you. got this. Fuck you mean I ain't getting paid? Out of the way, freshman. Oh no, nah, we definitely don't got this. <sighs> Reggie, oh, God. Lucky I'm not gonna make him sweep up the glass. Come here, my sharp little friends. No, bro, this is not this is not right. Moonlighting, huh? Hey, photography's a tough industry. Next time, remember That was so awkward. Why was that so awkward? Why was that interact? Dude, that was like a quick 15 second of awkwardness. Oh, my bladder thanks you. Tell your bladder it's my pleasure. So, hey, you were going to say something before all that. Uh, beer recommendations. Recommend a beer for someone who hates the taste of beer. Handlebar cider. That's the max ist thing on tap. How did you- It's my job to know the regulars. I am the all-seeing eye of Lakeport, Vermont. <laughs> You're starting to sound like one of those Abraxas guys. That dork-ass rich kid secret society bites your tongue. Ah, uh, your family? Those photos on the wall over there. Is that your family? Yep. All six of us, my poor mother. <laughs> I love those goobers. Plus, I'm the oldest, so they have to do what I say. Mm. Misery cult? So, you're a misery cult fan? For sure. <laughs> so cool that you know them. I don't actually know them. No, sorry. I actually had never heard of them until I read your wreck on the whiteboard. Oh, right. You're not a Lakeport local, duh. <laughs> so, educate me. I want to know. Misery Cult were the first band out of Lakeport to make it big. They kind of founded the Lakeport music scene. How big are they? What does make it big mean in this context? Sorry guys, my camera died. Give me a second. I mean, they got college radio airplay as far away as New Hampshire. So yeah. <laughs> Pretty big. Mm, pickup lines. I gotta know what the deal is with the pickup lines. My buddy Henry and I were co-headlining a comedy night. Holy shit, you do comedy? And this is the first I'm hearing about it? Sorry, sorry. Listening quietly, please proceed. So the whole drive up, he's telling me the grossest pickup lines he can think of, trying to get me to squirm. Dumb bro shit. Anyway, it turned into a competition, which I won. Nobody knows grosser pickup lines than a small town lesbian. And the competition turned into the chalkboard? So? Give it a shot. What's the best pickup line you've got? Hey, baby. I seem to have lost my number. Can I borrow yours? What was that? I like your enthusiasm. <laughs> We should hang out sometime. So, I was thinking... That we should totally do something in Lakeport sometime? You could show off the local music scene. Oh, hell yeah. There's this band, Revenge Horse, that I've been meaning to check out. Based on that name alone, I'm 100% in. So, um... Ugh. Uh, I like to make sure that boundaries get set early. Uh, so, zero pressure, either way. But... 
Is this a date thing or is this a friend thing? Ooh, this is where I gotta decide. Yeah, I knew it. Guys, listen, man. I've never been that tight to make my characters date. Especially with Max and Chloe. I kind of wanted to keep it separate. I'm going to go with the friend thing. I have to. I was thinking more of a friend thing. Cool. That's why I asked. Oh, let me find out. She want to eat my pussy. Friend thing it is. Oh, she gave me them numbers? Look at you, Max, doing normal people shit like some kind of healthy, productive member of society. How do you feel? I have no idea. The last 10 minutes are a total blur. But Amanda's really cool. Ooh. How's this? Hey. <laughs> oh, how was the shoot? We almost died. We didn't almost die. Yeah, because I saved us. I deserve a medal. <laughs> so what are we doing? The night's young. We should hang out. Just the three of us? There's a meteor shower tonight. I'm conducting research, but it could be fun with other people. You should come. Both of you. That's perfect. All we need is... Hold on. <laughs> she's a mile a minute tonight. She gets this way when she's in a good mood. Courtesy of Madame President, Mommy Dearest. At least until she remembers that I have her credit card. Huh? <laughs> Shall we? All right. Give me the Cliff Notes version of what we're actually here to see. A bunch of little pieces of a shattered asteroid. From 11 million miles away. This is what I get for introducing you to. Wow. So should we be worried about this crazy asteroid hitting Earth? <laughs> Not in our lifetime. And it will probably disintegrate before it reaches the surface. All right, Max. You have 24 hours before the world ends. What would you do? What was I going to do anyway? Take a picture? Oh, I'm documenting that shit. Can you imagine how cool an apocalypse photo set would be? Oh my god, this again? Nobody would see it. I'm telling you, art requires an audience. Otherwise, it's just... Okay, jeez. Agree to disagree. Awful quiet over there, Murph. Don't want to weigh in? Oh, uh, I wasn't listening. But, hey, looks like the equipment's working. Eek, why am I not at home wrapped up in a blanket burrito right now? Ah, uh, because you're a good friend. Fear of missing out? You're right, this was a terrible idea. Because, despite your attempts to convince us otherwise, you're a really sweet person. And you wanted to spend time with us. Aww. <laughs> oh, I brought cups. Figured that was better than passing the bottle around. Raw, so they're not real friends. What the fuck kind of cup is that? A big. Oh! As you could do. I don't work in this building. Don't blame me for the astronomy department's bad taste. Mine says I'm the world's horniest grandma. Grab a mug, Max. <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, does it actually say that? Nerdy and dirty? Where does it say that? Nerd I'm, I'm taking that nerdy and dirty one. Well, one out of two ain't bad. I'm taking that. Wait, where did it say that? And why did he just look at me I like that? I have some good news. Uh, it's big, but I can't tell you what it is. You can't tell us you have Bro, good I hate news. people like that. I don't want to say anything else until everything is finalized. Mysterious. Well, whatever we're celebrating, I think it calls for a selfie. Oh, let me. I just got this camera, and I want to get some good use out of it. What should we say? Damn. I think I have hypothermia. Huh? 
Moses has hypothermia. What? <laughs> so I'm random. I like Moses the most. I'm not gonna yeah. lie. You know. Um, like I don't even like Max that much. As much as I did. Not yet, at least. Moses, though, I, I'm I'm digging Moses. Good pause. news, huh? Pause, pause, pause. You two and your secrets. How you ever hold a conversation with each other is beyond me. Right? Oh, I'm saying. I'm right. dying to know what Sophie's what the good fuck? news is. Maybe I can somehow can. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Crosstalk, Pat. What the hell is crosstalk? Huh? Open mic now. Oh, it's like a little Instagram. Uh oh wow. I'm really out here posting all these on crosstalk. Vince her to spill. Uh messages. Mom and dad, please take care of yourself. I'm on the way from the airport, okay. I'm so sorry about the broken glass, Max. Please don't let Amanda ban me for life from the snapping turtle. Alright, speak to Moses for info on Sophie's secret. Hey, Moses. Doesn't some small part of you want to know what Sophie's good news is? All right. I think I have an idea. But once we go down this road, we can't turn back. Um, okay. Give this to Sophie, if you can. You'll probably have to trick her into taking Yo, why does Moses look like the homie Afro sends you? Prank? No. This has rules. So it's more of a game. I can't be the only one. Whoever holds the bottle <laughs> has to do whatever you say. Well, within reason. Moses, I have literally never wanted to play a game more in my entire life. You say that now. But Safi has a very loose definition of within reason. And she'll come for you next. No, I can't see that. Okay. Wish me luck. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Oh, you mean like talking to someone who has an obvious crush on me? First of all, how dare you? Second of all, yes, exactly. Okay. Hiding spot for a How am I going to plant this on Safi? I say right here in the snow. Right? I mean that only makes sense. Safi eats these when she can't slip away for a smoke. Okay. Dang, Safi snagged the good stuff from the snapping turtle. I'm I'm saying though, like why don't we hide it in the snow? Maybe over here? Oh no, Mr. Iceman. What's to become of your head? All right. Um. I need to hide this bottle cap somewhere that Safi won't find suspicious. Could I hide the bottle cap in a snowball? Yes. Not sure I want to rely on my. We're not we doing that. All right, Sniper Max. Let's lock and load. Wait, what? Now I've just got to deliver this to Safi. <laughs> what? Fuck. Should have seen that coming. <laughs> Holy shit. The hell, Max? <laughs> Damn, I had plans for that bottle cap too. Bullshit! How did you see me? Get good, noob. <laughs> You're the worst. Not at hiding bottle caps, no. I'm not. Your title <laughs> is secure. <laughs> oh. Oh, shit. Hello? This is Safi? Yes, this is Safia Llewellyn Fayad. Speaking. Be right back. Is 
Something ain't right. So, uh, would you really take pictures of the end of the world? Yeah. Think about it. I take photos of empty buildings. An empty planet? <laughs> That's next level. Okay. But it's like Safi said. Nobody is ever going to see them. Hmm. That's not the point. Sure, but... Who cares? I take a lot of photos nobody ever sees. I want to go out doing something I'm good at. You know? Huh. Oh, what? No, nothing. Just... Didn't take you as a... It's the journey, not the destination type. I mean, I guess I'm not. It's more like... Sometimes you reach the destination alone. And that's okay. Look at that! What a tale. Moses was right. This is awesome. Hold on, I'm trying to catch it though. Oh, not, not catch that. Wait, 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 wait. I didn't mean to say catch that. What? Are you okay? Y yeah. All good. Just dizzy. Maybe the champagne. I'm gonna take off, get some rest. I can give you a ride if you wait a few minutes. No, that's okay. I think a walk will clear my head. I think so. Huh. Interesting. Okay, the game is kind of growing on me. Can't lie, started off a little slow. For sure. Nah, headphones. Like, all right, look, man. I'm going to tell y'all something. Headphones while walking. Oh, beautiful song. Probably can't even play because it it's copyright. Hmm. Hey. I'm glad Moses invited me out tonight. Yeah. Short. Stay there for like maybe six minutes. But we're gonna we gonna take it. Come on. Let's get up out of here, man. What a perfect night for walking home. I'll just catch up with Sophie tomorrow. Head home. Uh, how the hell will you head home? Oh, right here. Okay, cool. Oh, the music is beautiful, though. Okay. The fuck? Loud ass owl. Polaroid. I'm taking that. Another Polaroid. You know I'm taking that. Who's? <laughs> nice. Ah. Don't do that, bro. Oh my gosh, she's a rookie. No. Don't do that. Don't get to take a shot like this every day. Stupid. Stupid. I already told you. This is not a test. Max! The emergency broadcast system is now in effect. I caused this. I caused all of this! Max? Hey! Hey, hey, are you okay? Something's wrong. 
Safi. Hey! Come back! Did she just run away? There's Safi. She seems okay. I feel like I should check on her anyway. Better safe than sorry. Okay. We could do that, for sure. Shit! What? Safi, hang on! What the fuck? Shots fired! Safi's fine. Oh my For god. For a moment, I thought. Oh my god. So, are we cool or what? Safi, why you keep running though? Safi. Safi. That ain't no Safi. Safi? Hey. You okay? Oh my gosh, she's dead. What? Max! But rewind! Where's Max's rewind powers? Nah, you did it. I seen it. No. Bro, where are y'all? Why does this setting feel like we're starting in Chicago? It is Chicago. What part of Chicago? I don't know what part. Shot is crazy, though. Let me find out they're really out here in the field. Damn. Damn! Why am I smiling? That's messed up. She died. Life is strange. Double exposure. All right, well, all right, guys. Well, listen, that's gonna wrap it up for part one to chapter one. If you guys, uh, honestly, guys, it's I kind of like it. It's not. It's it started off slow, but now I feel like it's getting a little interesting. So it's not bad. I don't think it's gonna be bad. I don't know. Let me know what y'all think though. Are we coming back for part two? Or are we just feeling it? I don't know. This and this all depends on y'all. No like, go, no nothing. Y'all want a part two? You already know what to do though. Hit that like button. I'm going to wrap this off here. Thank y'all so much for watching, though. I love y'all. Take care, and goodbye. Thanks again for dropping in, and we hope you've enjoyed the evening as much as we've enjoyed having you here. Till next time, please drive carefully, and good night now. <laughs>